How's it going everyone and welcome back to some more Golden Sun Dark Dawn. So, last time we left off at Kalchu, actually specifically the Ouroboros, a maze of gigantic proportions in which we were dropped after refusing to participate in a war for a warlord. Yeah. That was not fun. Not fun at all. But, in the positive side, we rescued Reef, got three or four more gin. I don't know, honestly. I do know that my stupid self managed to skip over another two gin that I can't get until I get out of here. So, yeah. Let's start. But before that, I need to adjust some things. We are in the Ouroboros. We were sent here by a tyrannical ruler. Okay, I just wanted to check out, because it's been a while since I played Dark Dawn, I wanted to check out what my status is. Hmm, okay. Okay, it seems pretty reasonable, let's go. Let's see if we can get out of this alive. Oh, this is reminding me a lot of, um... Huh, oh, what's it called? Oh, I can, oh, I can push these, okay. Oh, roll. <laughs> yeah, nice try, buddy. Nice try. Get out of the way. Oh, we're back in Kaucho? You have to be kidding me. It couldn't be that easy, could it? Okay, maybe it could be that easy. I don't know. Did you? Did we really just? Uh, Yeah, I think we just escaped. Okay. Uh, sorry for any lag issues today, because this is se Oh, okay, we did not. I was here a earlier, I, I remember I was here. Yeah, I, yeah, I'd like to apologize for any lag issues, because I just started my computer. Yeah, we were here! How the hell did we get out? Okay, I, I'm... I'm guessing I wasn't supposed to have done that. Wait, what? What, what, uh? Oh wait, yeah, it's through here, what the hell am I doing? So... What the hell happened? What the hell just happened? I, I don't understand. We got sent down there. Halt. Who goes there? Oh. Okay, then. So maybe we were supposed to... <sighs> nah, I'm not satisfied. Be right back, guys. Okay, we're back at the Ouroboros. I, I really need to see if that was the only thing I could do here, because... Man, this seems such like an incomplete dungeon. I swear, man, if this is an incomplete dungeon, I'm gonna be pissed. I'm gonna be legit pissed. <laughs> Yeah, what the hell, dude? It seems like we're gonna... We're gonna get here later on, but... What? Oh, that's disappointing. That's incredibly disappointing, dude. I thought this was gonna be like some sort of amazing giant dungeon. Oh, that's incredibly disappointing, dude. Oh. God damn it. Well, where do we go next? Hold on, let me just consult my cheat sheet. Enter the palace area of Kaucho at the round middle. Okay, apparently there's a Jinny next to the palace. Alright, let's see that Jinny. Oh, come on. Come on, you've got to be kidding me. Yeah, this is lagging a lot. Still don't know why though. Okay, let's see what we can do. So... What does it say? At around the middle part of the staircase, use grip. Okay... Here? No one would thought in their... In, no one in their right minds would thought... would think of uh, using grip. 
Oh, to the left. <laughs> oh, to the left flagpole. Okay. I I goofed. How the hell do I get out of here? Oh, okay. Oh, what is this? Oh, I knew you could go here. But what is on this side? What is there on this side? Okay, nothing, basically. <laughs> oh, I get it. So we can't go to the palace. No, 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 this side. Uh, this, this has some hard controls, I'm not gonna lie. And why is not- okay, there you go. I wanted that to show my party. So... So, let's see. Go down the ladder and head down the river by your side to the turn part, okay. Coach, steel is just a lily pad away. Okay, so it's a Venus genie. Oh, there- How did I- What?! That's crazy! How did I miss you?! How the hell did I miss you? The Venus Genie still joined you, it's set to Matthew. Oh my god, I see that glitch. The Sloth Spirit is first found in Calcio. Steals attack is a vitality stealing kiss that leaves enemies wanting more. Okay. Hold on one second, be right back. Okay, so I seriously don't know what the hell's happening. I'm sorry I, I just randomly teleported. I know it was kind of strange. Oh, so, um... Yeah, quick question, how the hell do I get out of here? I may have gotten myself stuck. Oh, not really, okay, I can get out of Kaucho through here. So there's nothing really to do in Kaucho for now, apparently. Uh, I can't believe I might get stuck. North Northeast Kaucho, I didn't, didn't I click this? This powerful nation was founded by King Wu, who covets the treasures of the IJ region and wages war against Basaj and Ayuthai. So let's go to Ayuthai. Okay, Cobalt. This should be easy. I like how they all thought we were gonna get trapped there and we just... Oh uh, yeah, whatever. Sure. Well, for a normal person, it would be kinda hard to get out of there, honestly. And we're entering that critical phase of the Golden Sun series, like, the middle phase of the story has always been, like, super problematic for the story because it's... super slow-paced. And I mean super slow-paced. Think- take for example- oh. oh, I can climb up, okay, nice. Haven't we just- oh. What are you? What are you, dude? Oh yeah, Curse has a bow, I forgot about that. Okay, it died, nice. So, as I was saying, just recall uh, the first Golden Sun and the- oh my god. So this is Ayuthai. We're busy taking over this palace, I can't let you pass unless you have business here. So visit Kaochu if you want to get into the army business, King Wo is the man with the master plan. Oh, that's right! That's right! Is that a letter from Culture Palace? Oh, King Wu didn't advise it! It's a letter from the palace! It must be a king! From the looks of it, King Wu has sent you. So you're here to aid our assault on Ayuthai? Sure, dude, we are. Welcome then, friends. We need good warriors to help Culture smash Ayuthai. Come on in! Thank you a lot, dude. Our generals Kutsung and Kuembra are across the pond. This, yeah, this younger of the two culture generals is celebrated for his swordsmanship. He is a master of the zealous fury attack. Okay, we're gonna fight him. The Kuembra is brash and temperamental and is like his co-general and brother, Kutsung. Yikes, I mean, lucky you. <laughs> you better get that letter to the generals fast. <laughs> I got a feeling that you two don't like the generals that much. Why would if you come to enjoy a good war, you're going to be disappointed. Yaithai are nowhere to be found. So we're just standing around, awaiting for additional orders. Oh. 
Are we supposed to use another thing? Let me just... Okay, I really don't know what to... Oh, I should... I... Oh, I, I had to use that again? He's got a communication from the palace? That's too important for my eyes. Okay, whatever. So people here are... yeah. Oh, the hell? Trying to get across the pond, there's no raftsman here to paddle you to the other side. Maybe you can win for a strong... Oh! I, what did he say? That are the hot hair from one of King Will's proclamations. Are you serious? Am I, am I really gonna get stuck here? Oh, you have a letter from the king. Seriously, you need to... Oh! Uh. And so he said a hot wind. Can I use Ruben on this? Yeah, I can't. Oh, this is gonna be fun, isn't it? I can already see how this is gonna go. What is going on, dude? Oh, I can climb this! Okay, I'm hopelessly lost. <laughs> I went to visit Kaucho, I got stuck in the Ouroboros for a short while, and then they just tossed me here. Oh, a barrel. Oh! Thank you! Uh, yeah, now what? Give your letter to the judge, but don't waste any their time, whatever you do. Isn't there anything I can do? There has to be something. Oh, thank god I can! Oh, apparently I cannot. So, yeah, I'm stuck. Yeah, they're across the pond. How the hell will I get there? There has to be some way to get there, dude. Okay, no, Whirlwind appeared, which means... It must be Whirlwind. I'm just missing something. Oh! I'm so dumb, dude. Of course it would be the opposite way. Okay, but it's not this way. Oh, might as well set Roman to R. So we can't go up, we have to go down. Oh, we're just going back in circles, aren't we? Karis is running out of PP fast. Okay, I, I guess I'm gonna make another cut then. Oh god. Just do it! Oh wait! Oh! I'm s once again, I'm pretty stupid. Oh, I can jump. Damn it! I want that chest. Uh, let's go up. Oh, there they are. I don't understand why they made the layout of this city so stupid. Gimme. What do you have? Oh, a cookie! It's been a while since I saw one of those. Raises maximum PP permanently. Who should I give it to? Karis already has a lot of PP. Ugh, god, who? Oh, decisions, decisions. You know what, I'm gonna give it to Matthew because he's he's gonna be using a lot of, um, m field moves. Exactly. Nice. Thank you, Scott. Thank you, Kairos. Let's see what we have. Huh? Oh, okay. So I guess there's nothing here as well. Dude, this game is also really unclear at giving you directions. <laughs> but that's a fundamental problem with the series and not with the game itself. Golden Sun was never really the best at giving directions, let's be honest. <laughs> right, Mr. Eastern Sea? Well, just a, a nice reference to the Lost Age. Where you, where you wander around like Apogee Islands, Champa, stuff like that, and you don't know what the hell you're doing. Okay, let's see what... Oh! Oh, I see you! I see you there, little Ginny! The Aithe people of Ranscare, they abandoned their city, now we await new words from culture. Yeah, we don't have to give it to these guys, okay. 
There was a guy here, what was he doing? I don't mind conquering a country for King War, but some of the orders he sends make him sound like a bully. So yeah, we don't have to yeah, we don't have to show this to anyone but the generals. Okay. I see you, how the hell am I gonna get to you? The generals are planning their strategy right now. Only those with urgent mi yeah. Uh, not you, Reef. So we really needed to go to Kaucho first. Okay. Follow me. Thank you. <laughs> They're laughing, really. <laughs> They're planning their strategy. <laughs> sure. Excuse me, generals? We're busy right now. We must purge the evil spirits. Please, generals, we have visitors from Kaucho. These people possess a letter from King Wu. Eh? They don't look like Kaucho warriors. Mm, never mind, show me the letter then. Okay, I'm gonna save. I smell a boss fight coming. Leave Kaucho in search of clues. The Ouroboros holds the mysterious soul mask, but you have no way deeper inside. There must be clues elsewhere in the southern half of the continent. You do possess King Gold's letter to his generals. Okay, so they do give out the instructions. I'm just gonna casually reach my bag and uh... I have a Psy Crystal, don't I? I don't have a Psy Crystal, that's fantastic! Oh, screw it. We've got a letter from King Wool, give it to me. Here you go. This thing is the key to eyesight. <laughs> what does it say, General Kunsung? King Wool writes that Matthew has come with his companions to help us with their synergy. Puny people, help us with synergy? I believe it that when I see it. They look like a pack of pups, not powerful adepts. But the letter is from King War. His Majesty cannot be wrong. In that case, I wonder why His Royal Highness has sent them here. He didn't. <laughs> his letter promises that they will help us with our assault on Ayutai. The King is infallible. But these worms, they're not worth my attention. I need veteran warriors. Uh, excuse me, generals. May I go back to my post outside? Hold your tongue, soldier. We'll dismiss you when you when you're good, we're good and ready. Now, General Kuembra, I know of a test we can put to these adepts. I have one half adepts underfoot. They'll only trip up our plans to push deeper into the castle. But we can't move deeper until the evil spirits here are exercised. These adepts can do that, I'm sure. Ah oh, yes, now that's a good idea, General Kutsuk. This castle is plagued by all mind manner of fiends. Clean up the palace. We will be waiting outside while you do the dirty work. Tell us when you're finished. These scumbags. <laughs> These guys are something else. Okay then. Uh, good luck with that. I'll just be outside where it's less haunted. So I'm guessing this is a dungeon. I heard the laughing when we arrived, but it's gone now. Let's watch out for those evil spirits. We wouldn't want them sneaking up on us. Hey, evil spirits! Hello? I used to have somewhat of a mystery at the moment. But you know, a journey up the pass uh, mountains to Passage might yield some answers. The leaders of Passage and Ayutai do know each other, and their people have shared ancestry. I believe that we should trek to Passage just to see what work we can find. Are you kidding me? You're making me go on a wild goose chase! Let me see what this says, yeah, okay. I'm not going anywhere, I'm going to see what the hell this place holds. And I saw Jupiter Genie, I'm not leaving without him. They're really making me go on a, on a wild goose chase, aren't they? I'm gonna use Plasma. Ugh. 
God, it's it's been like so, a lot uh, some time since I played the Dark Dawn, and now I replayed it and I'm like, what the hell is going on? <laughs> How are they not dead? Oh, oh god, the lag. <laughs> Okay, there we go. Hey, my <gasps> Ragnarok, yes! Finally! Matthew learned Ragnarok. That's gonna be useful, actually. Oh, really useful. Looks like a stone gate, but there's no possible way through here. Okay. Okay, then. What the hell, dude? There's a growth plan here. Matthew already has 202 HP with- Oh, that's right, because the Venus Genie is with him, sealed. Oh god, why is it lagging so much? It wasn't lagging this badly before. Oh, no. Let's see. Jesus, Matthew! Oh, Matthew mastered the Vorpal Slash, that's a really good technique. There we go. Kill it! There we go. 260 experience points. Okay, there must be something in this. Are you kidding me? What? Okay, there's an entrance. Let's see what, where this leads us. This leads us up higher, okay? Mm, oh, what? What is that? Interesting. Oh, are you kidding me? <laughs> ha, come on! Get in! Thank you. Oh, I... Can I burn this? Let's see if I can burn this. I probably can't. Yeah, I can't. That's probably what's gonna lead me to the Jinny. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, I'm outside. What is this? <gasps> the, the stone face upon this ancient tree has its eyes closed. If it is waking to be woken up. Okay. This reminds me a lot of Kalima Forest. Oh. 53 coins. I'll take it. Yeah, but in the meantime, let's go to passage then. So, yeah, I'm stuck in a... I'm stuck in Aijai, which is the lower section of uh, Angara, apparently. Oh yeah, I still haven't. F uh, oh yeah, okay. Oh, I get it. We can't go up. It has to be through the growth planty thing. Are you kidding me? Oh, pixies! It's been a while since I. S oh, let's try this out. One does he wave, the other does Ragnarok. Let's see what's gonna happen. Okay, nothing's gonna happen because they both died with a, a single plasma. I guess so. Okay, we're, yeah, there's nothing to do here. Let's get out. Can I use retreat, please? Yes, please. Oh, oh, retreat doesn't work. <laughs> I hope, I hope you understand. I hate you. I've noticed that there are a few graphical glitches. Not sure what's causing them. I have the DS in the same settings as the last episode. Maybe they've always been there, and I just don't notice. Come on, do it. I feel like I'm not making a lot of progress this episode. <laughs> I've made much more progress in the last episodes. Okay, so this is... Let's see the map. We're stuck in in a tiny section, okay. We're gonna encounter... Yeah, there we go. A, a hoggle gob. A hobble gob. What the hell is that name, dude? Let's just finish this starburst. Let's go! They take a lot of damage! Damn! 
Okay, the middle one's dead, and Reef probably will finish off the other. Okay, yeah, definitely. Karis is level 13, and so is Tyrell. And so is Reef, and Reef learned Restore. What I want Reef to learn is, is uh, Wish. But he probably won't learn Wish now that I think about it. Okay, let's let's see. Uh, Passage is to the northwest. Let's see. Ignore it. Okay. Apparently. Okay. A ghost. In oh, okay. I'm gonna run. Oh, are you serious? Come on. Just let me get away, please. Come on. Let me let me run. Thank you. There has to. There, okay. Yeah, it's through here. The passage mountain climb is that way. Let's see. When you first see it in the passage mountain climb, ignore it and go left, go left to find Green Zoll. Right? Oh god, the leg. It's because I clicked out of the game. Sorry. It's, a, an, it's an extremely laggy episode. It's been a while since I've been this laggy on a video or stream. In fact, I think... Oh my god, I love the symbol for Restore. It's gotten such an upgrade. Okay, the Harpy fell asleep, the middle Harpy. Ouch. Let's go! Jeez. Tyrell is such an overpowered character, dude. So I guess we'll have to go this way then. North, passes Mount Yep. So this is it. We went here a few, a few, uh, last episode actually. We found there was no way up. Oh! Oh yeah, that's right. We also seen this. I love this theme so much. We've already went to that chest, so there's... Four ghosts! Yeah, I'm just gonna run, thank you. Thank you! Oh, come on. The ladder has been cut. It must have happened when Passage was attacked by culture warriors. So we can't climb up. We had seen this before. So how the hell... Is there some kind of synergy that allows us to get through? I don't think so. Can I grab anything? Yeah, I can't. Oh, there is! How am I so stupid? Am I really that dumb? I completely forgot those flowers! Wow! I was supposed to go here first! I'm so dumb! And Matthew just one shot again. Wow! I can't believe it. Oh, the lag! What? Okay, that was an accident, I swear. But apparently we have to do that to all of them. Okay. Another four ghosts. Okay, I'm sick of this. Okay. Buffet folk perhaps twice would give for us. No, no thank you. Let's just finish them off. Yeah, you can defend Reef. Ouch. Kaboom! One of the ghosts survived. Actually, two of them. Kill him! <laughs> And Matthew once again just coming through. If there's one thing no one can uh, shun this uh, 
shit this game down for is the soundtrack, dude. It's amazing. So let's see. Wind Advisory. Dangerous path ahead. Vi very high chance of horrible gusts. Passage safety board. Okie dokie then. I can't move this? Really? Can I whirlwind it at least? Okay, I can't. Tell me I can move this one. How the hell am I going to do this? Okay, let's see. You're gonna get blocked, thank you. This reminds me a lot of Air's Rock. <laughs> it's funny. How the hell am I gonna get through here? Oh! Ooh, I get it. So this is a, a sort of gigantic puzzle. Who are you? Oh, this is Zol! Welcome to our Zol Mine. We are gathering all the floating Zol stones we can find. Let's see what this is. This unique mineral, also called floating stone, floats in the air when touched by wind. Then send them higher on the updrafts in here. Zol floats on the wind, you know. Whoa, really? This is actually really cool. The ancients used their synergy to blow these Zol stones around. Oh, I wish I could do that. Interesting, thanks for the tip. What a pain! We can't get back into town since the winds are so strong right now. Guess I'll have to wait. Good thing there are no monsters in here as well. So, yes. Exactly. And, it, oh, the whirlwind stays there. That's actually really cool. The little details like this is, are always are always welcome. Okay, I'm getting kind of tired of this, so I'm gonna do something really quick. Way better. I know it's a, a little rough around the edges, but it's the best option I have. Oh, I probably goofed. Yeah, I, I goofed. Oh. Oh, God. So, how are we gonna do this? Okay, let's see. Run. Yeah, I goofed. Oh, I'm stuck? Oh! Oh, I get it. So he's just gonna stick permanently there. We have a setup for this, for picking up that, that chest. Let's go. Oh, come on! Thank you. Let's see what we got. Oh, it's a wand! The blow mace! Dude, this was the best thing to have on Shiva. And I can give it to Matthew, but nah. Uh, the Femi Sex. Yeah, I'm gonna give it to, yeah. I'm gonna give it to Tyrell. The Yumbling Rapier is already a really good sword for Matthew. Where are we? Oh, I see a genie on my map. Oh! First, ignore it. It's really hard to ignore something right there. I'm not gonna ignore it, sorry. Well, so my cheat sheet says to ignore the Ginny and completely just pass through it, but I'm I'm not one for that life. So let's go. So there you were. I thought I thought, hey, I couldn't have passed it. I, I didn't pass through here yet, so how the hell did I miss it? Oh my god, Gust on an arrow looks so cool! Oh, Thorin, that's gonna hurt. Jesus. Hey. And it's wrapped in delusion. Let's just finish it. Let's go, Karis. Did it just dodge an arrow? Props to that Ginny. Another Ginny for the party. This one is gonna go to Reef, I guess. Yeah, this is much better in, in, in the, the terms of graphics. 
The Venus Genie Bar joined you, it's set to read. The stuff spirit is the first is first met on Passage Mountain Climb. Bark's roof hide can protect allies like a shield. Let's see, uh, yeah, let's set all these back. What? I wanna see the status of Reef with this with this guy around. Oh my god, they're so cute. Let's see. So he has Douse Froth, Growth, Mad Growth, Cure and Cure Well, Cure Poison and Restore. Okay, it's not a bad set, not by any means. Thank you. Okay, let's run. Okay, let's go. It's set to ignore it. Let's just to solve the small puzzle. Slide those all right. Climb up the ladders. Yeah, you could you could get it. Okay, you could get it either way. I think. All right, see ya. This thing is high, dude. This really reminds me of Air's Rock. Are you sure we're not in Osania? Like, near Garo? Oh, a troll. It's been a while since I saw one of those. Those guys are dangerous. We have to, I have to take them out. Damn. Yes! The gloriousness of Ragnarok in 3D. Now it's there's almost no lag in battles. That is what I wanted. The Harpy's gonna attack. Of course, it's Matthew. And yeah, this is gonna finish it. <laughs> Fire in this laser. I already level 14, dude. Okay, remember when I said earlier in the episode that I wasn't doing like any progress at all? I di I disagree with myself right about now. This is the most progress I've done in an episode so far. I think. <gasps> Quake Sphere, yes! Man, we're getting some good moves fast, and I like to see that. Let's use Froth. Jupiter Adept are still the glass cannons of always. Karis is still the member with less health of the team. Reef just used Bubble. And I obtained a useless elixir, let's go. I think I'm getting close to the end. <gasps> no, I don't know how to get you, my cheat sheet isn't updated. No matter, I'm always I'm almost hiding get ending the episode anyway, so. I'll get you! Don't worry. We're in passage! Oh, this thing. We've climbed all the way to that mountain uh, town of passage. I can't wait to see it again. Now, follow me to the very spot that Creighton believed was the only way across the peaks. We're almost to the passage that Creighton believed would lead across the Kiran Mountains. How much do you want to bet we're gonna find Blados? It's above the town. Let me take you there directly. We can come back to explore passage later. Okay. So we're without Reef right now. Yes, we are. So, this is the way across the Kirin Mountains. What? But we're so high in the clouds that there's nowhere to go! Nonetheless, this is the spot that Kraden believed was the key to crossing over. That's impossible! We're at the very top of this mountain! How can we go anywhere from here except back down? If only we had a sword wing with us. Oh, that's true. The feather of a mountain rock is what gives this invention its gliding power. If trained, adepts can use a sword wing to fly with high precision. Yeah, Tyrell, isn't that right? But here's the crux of the matter. See that mountain across the sky? That's Craggy Peak. Creighton says that the ancient ancestors of us adepts lived there. Oh. This mountain was once home to the Neox. Their ancient but highly advanced civilization created many remarkable devices. They were known as the Jenne. Our ancestors lived there and many other places across Wayard. So these guys are the predecessors to the actual adepts. In ancient times, those who could use synergy were known as the Jenne. With their powers and their understanding of alchemy, the Jenne created a great civilization which all fitted when alchemy proved too dangerous for the ancient rule. Basically, these guys existed until the ancients decided it was the best idea to seal off alchemy. 
The Jenny that lived on that peak were known as the Neox, and they were looked over and they looked over this part of the world. Okay. The Jenny ruled all civilization with their powers. Those who lived in that is now in what is now lives Okay, <laughs> let me read that again. The Jenny ruled all civilization with their powers. Those who lived in what is now known now called Craggy Peak were called the Neox. The Neox worked with the Exavi to create the alchemy machines. Oh. But when alchemy vanished from the world, so did the Neox. I have heard of these alchemy machines before, and I hear I heard they were gonna be like a central point to the story. Did Kraven think that the Neox used their powers to travel between here and there? Well, look at the platform you're standing on. It's obviously not from this town. Exactly. He thinks they could create some sort of sky passage between the peaks. The Neox Jane worked with the ancient people of Passage to create a machine that could manipulate the clouds. Craven said that such machines were based on alchemy principles. The one in Passage is called the Alchemy Forge. Oh, I wanted to... Oh. Well, show us the way to this machine then. Uh, it's not so simple. Craven can figure out how to get Passage's, Passage's uh, Alchemy Forge running. Let's see. Alchemy Forge. This ancient machine was built by the Neox and is powered by the elemental of fire. It is thought to create wondrous things. But Craven is a genius. How can we succeed when he couldn't? We have to figure it out. There is no other way to reach Belinth can catch up with Craven. If only Isaac and Garrett knew what the hell was happening. Not to mention getting to Morgul to find that feather. If only we hadn't run to those fiends in the cave. Hey, Blados had a direct hand in forcing us into the south part of Angara. But why is that masked man tagging along with him? Yes! Cars aren't uh, asking the real questions here. Why is he? Why is him? He. That specific person there. You know, that guy who wanted to know if we had the glyph book? He was eager to send us south to find you, Grief. He was eager to send us south to find you, Reef, not Craven. From what I could gather, it seemed that Craven suspected his true identity. I got the feeling that they knew each other pretty well. They did. Do you think so? Perhaps that explains why Craven was so willing to part ways. No! He doesn't like him! Well, I can't imagine they'd be friends, but old allies, perhaps? That's an interesting point, actually. Could we call Kraden and Alex old allies? They did work together at some point to create the... to light up the lighthouses. This is really interesting, actually. Huh. Maybe. I trust Kraven, but I can't see trusting anything about. I can't see trusting anything about that masked man or Blados, or Blados. I don't know how it's how is it said. I don't see how this help us get across the sky. Now, if only we did have a sword wing, right, Tyrell? Right, right. <laughs> Too bad that ours is broken. Of course, we wouldn't be here if it wasn't for that. So all we have in is, in is an ancient legend about a machine that could make a cloud passage. This guy is like the Ivan of the group in terms of the intellect. Ivan was always the smartest. I wish I had pride more, more details from Kraven when we were last here. No use fretting about it now. I guess we'll just have to investigate for this ourselves. That's the only way we'll get to that peak. So, we have nothing but a dusty Jenny leg legend to go on. That's all. Just a Jenny and a, fa a fabled cloud passage to Craggy Peak. What? Have you had another thought, Reef? There was one more reason Kraden gave up on getting to that peak. He said we didn't have a wide enough variety of synergy to start the alchemy for it. Variety? What kinds of synergy did you think you needed? I don't know! 
Well, who else came here with you and Craven? Noel, right? Yeah, exactly. Just my sister, Noel. And we're both water adepts. According to the description, the Alchemy Forge is started with fire. Then maybe we have a chance because we cover all types of elemental energy. You might be right. Then let's find that Alchemy Forge, Reef. I'm sure that we'll create that cloud passage to Craggy Peak in no time. I didn't notice, notice it before. Things feel a little different from when I was last here. This place is brimming with synergy power now. Can you can't you feel it? I certainly wasn't like this before. Changes in the wind. The key to all of this is in passage. Let's head back to town then. I'm sure we'll uncover the secret there. All right. So we have the legend of an ancient alchemy machine ready to create a cloud passage to another mountain that will lead us to Belinsk. But there are many, and I mean many things, left unanswered in the southern part of Angara. For example, I can name two. Ayuthai, where is everyone? And why is it abandoned? And Ouroboros, how can we get the Soul Mask? But that is all gonna be answered next episode, because I'm ending it here. So, thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, please consider hitting that subscribe button if you are new to the channel and liking the video. If you want to get notified of my future stream slash uploads, hit that little notification bell. You know what to do. Until next time, peace!